Bobby, I do this thing often where I, I just call it pay it backwards. A lot of people do it when I'm in the drive through or at a restaurant or McDonald's. Pay it forward? I pay it for the person behind me. Oh, I see. Okay. So I call it pay it backward. Oh, okay. 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 So, so they can pay it forward. Right. But I, I do it. I do it every now and then, right? Uh, especially when I remember doing it. I yeah. don't care what they had behind me. I don't ask, what do they buy? I'm like, just pay for that. And so I was driving back from Portland last year. So I was able to cross the border freely because we're essential workers in logistics and I'm okay. the CEO. Yeah. So I was coming back from Portland and I had an amazing business trip. Like it was so successful and I was in a really good mood. And then I was starting my journey. I just crossed into Washington and I thought, okay, I need to eat something or so. Let me grab a coffee from the McDonald's and a little meal. And then I remembered, I'm like, oh, I haven't done the pay it backwards in a while. I'm like, you know what? Uh, I buy my meal and then I hesitate. I'm like, you know, I just wanna buy the meal for the person behind me. Mm -hmm. I did it. And then I paused and I said, you know what? I want to buy a $50 gift card and I want you to use it for the whole lineup or until it runs out. And that was the okay. biggest I've ever done. I was okay. just in a really good yeah. mood. Okay. They're like, oh great, thank you. So then I zip out, I go to the gas station. I need to fill up on gas and grab some water bottle. And back then I was still smoking, right? It was only uh, this year that I quit. And so I get gas on the company card. I go inside and I try using my debit card and my credit card. I had to use my personal, I can't put that on the company card, but they're gonna see cigarettes and whatever. So the card declined because I used it too many times at McDonald's. Okay. Too many times in a row there. Oh, and yeah, it's yeah, international. Yeah. So some, that's what I'm assuming why yeah. it declined. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I try all my cards from yeah. RBC and they don't work. Okay. So, and then I asked the guy, I'm like, you know what? I just, want to buy that pack of smokes it's ten dollars will you take a 20 canadian that's all i have i don't have u.s cash he said sorry i can't do that i'm like shoot let me just go outside i bet i could find somebody who will exchange a ten dollar u.s for a 20 canadian yeah i go outside i see this uh boy who looks like he's in college he's pumping gas for his jeep and i'm like excuse me could you give me a hand with something and he's like sure and i'm like I open up my wallet just so he doesn't think I'm sketchy. And I'm like, I just need $10 US and I only have a 20 Canadian. And he opens up his wallet and before I could even explain why, he had $10 in his wallet. He said, here you go, man. And I'm like, okay, here's this 20. He's like, no, no, just make sure you pay it forward. I'm like, no, man. I'm like, I need to give you something. And he's like, no, man, pay it forward. That's all, you, all I want from you. And I was like, well, thank you. I go inside and I see the uh, gas station tenant and I say, I'm like, hey, that guy gave me 10 bucks. Uh, well, I can buy those back to smoke so I can have a couple on my drive. And then the bill came to $11. He's like, oh, this is not Port Oregon. There's tax in Washington. I'm like, oh no. He's like, don't worry, man, I got you. And I'm like, really? He's like, yeah, I'll cover your dollar. He's like, just make sure you pay it forward. I'm like. I will. <laughs> so I take it and start. The story continues. Yeah. So I drive two, three hours, and or two hours now, and I need to get a little more gas, and I need to get more water bottles and like a Red Bull or something. And my friend had asked me to pick him up some chewing tobacco thing because he's a baseball player. So I go inside and. I forgot my car wasn't working, and so when I had all my stuff, it was declining, and I'm like, oh yeah, declined. And I try it again, I try it again, enter the pin, doesn't work. She's like, why don't you try the ATM? And I'm like, okay, let me go to the ATM. I go there to the ATM, and I'm just waiting, nothing's happening. Some man in the lineup said, hey, is that giving you trouble? I'm like, yeah. He's like, this is all your stuff, right? And I'm like, yeah. He's like, I got you. And I'm like, no, sir, you, you can't. Let me at least give you some Canadian money because I do have Canadian. He's like, no, 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 you're getting it. I'm like, okay, let me put the smoke or the chewing tobacco away and I don't need four water bottles. I don't need four Red Bulls. I, I'll just take one or one water, one Red Bull. He's like, no, you're getting it all. I'm like, really? He's like, yeah, just make sure you pay it forward. So he covered that for like 30 bucks. <laughs> all within four hours of me doing that one thing. Thank you for it.
true story. As no, unbelievable as no, it sounds. No, that's, uh, that's my life experience as well. <laughs> Good. Thank you.